good time. Congratulations. Gracias. <laughs> when I talked to you, I think it was, we're in season two, and now I, with the, my biggest favorite moment is you, sit, you tricking those gosh of vampires into letting you sit on that throne. Tell me yes. about that journey. Well, it's so funny because he he puts on this Machiavellian hat, like, you know, trying to take over without taking over. And Guillermo's very, very smart. So he's always kind of manipulated the vampires without knowing he manipulates them. But this season and last season, he really takes matters into his own hands. He just, he's tired of waiting around. He's tired of waiting for your turn to, to own your space, to hold space. So Guillermo's like, screw that. I'm going to just start taking initiative. And you know what? I'm really good at this. So let's see how far I can take it. And he's pushing the envelope for sure. How much have you enjoyed seeing the, the future scripts and seeing Guillermo's growth? Well, you know, I don't get to see the scripts that uh, advance. I actually get to see them like the day that we have the table read usually or the week of. So I don't really get them that advance ahead of time. So I'm always nice and surprised. So it's always when I get the script, I go through it. And I usually read the script and don't read the cover letter like to see who wrote it because I try to guess which writer wrote it. And usually I'm pretty dead on. Like when I, I can always guess when it's Stephanie or Sarah Neftalis, who's amazing, who uh, Paul Sims, Sam. I could always just, after so many years, I can kind of feel like, oh, I know their vibe and I can tell when they each write their scripts. Just real quick, any words to your growing fans? Because, I mean, you, you have quite the fan base now. Oh my gosh, thank you so much to all the fans who've been like so supportive for the last, you know, like years and years. And this year has been an amazing journey with what we do in the shadows and with other, you know, projects as well coming out. It's just been wonderful. And thanks to the FX family who's been so supportive of the show, who got picked up for season five and six, which is so astonishing and like, you know, crazy. And I can't believe we get to do this all over again for another two seasons and hopefully more. You never know. Harvey, it's a pleasure talking to you finally in person. I hope you enjoy your night. Thank you so thank much. You. Have a good night.